Hey everybody, how's it going? Um, Colby here. I know I just dropped episode 17 a couple, three hours ago, and no, this is not a surprise bonus um, episode this week. As most of you know, um, Tasha's Cauldron of Everything dropped today, and I wanted to talk about that briefly. Um, but first, I have to um, have a little errata um, correction, a mistake uh, from my from the episode that I that I just put out today, um, and it's it's big enough to to get its own little video, I think. Uh, a lot, since I'm talking about Tasha's anyway, I make plenty of mistakes, as you guys know. Many of you have pointed out to me, you know, I'll, I'll forget something in the rules, and it will kind of throw off the build slightly, but typically it doesn't have a real big impact. The one today had a significant enough of an impact. Thanks to um, Benry007, I wonder if he's a secret agent, um, he reminded me that, of course, when you, when you use, when you cast Booming Blade as an action, which was the primary action that we were taking every time as the swashbuckler build that I did. You can't do um, you can't do an offhand as a bonus action attack, right? With with your with your other hand, and do two weapon fighting. You can only do that when you take the attack action, and that's not the same thing as casting booming blade. Um, and so that does have an impact on the build and on the damage. Um, if I were a professional. I would just scrap the video and redo it from the beginning, um, but I'm not a professional. I'm very much an amateur and don't have the time probably to do that, so I apologize. Um, just know that the damage per round is going to be between 5 and 12 less. Um, I'll, I'll crunch the actual numbers and update the spreadsheet that I have posted to the show notes and video notes. Um, so that the spreadsheet numbers will be accurate, and they still are very good, by the way. Um, better than I even had, had had anticipated, just not quite as good as I was reporting. Um, so anyway, I'm going to update that, and just know that it, it's going to alter things from about 5 to 12 damage per round. You'll want to um, obviously use a rapier in your main hand from the get-go instead of a short sword, that'll help a little bit. You'll take a different fighting style, probably the duelist fighting style, which gives you a plus two damage when you're using a one-handed weapon. That'll help a little bit, but it's still overall going to be a damage loss. It does free up your bonus action now, which is nice. And maybe you guys can help me come up with a good suggestion for what to do with that bonus action if there's a good way to weaponize it. I'm not sure that there is as a ranger. I thought about hand crossbow with a crossbow expert feat, but then you have two weapons and you can't reload it every time. Um, anyway, there's things. Maybe Tasha's will guide me in that direction. So speaking of Tasha's, um, yes, it dropped today. And probably like many of you, I'm reading it as time allows, as quickly as I can, um, in between the other things that I have to do today. Um, I've already found lots of great interesting stuff and I've had a lot of requests from several of you to you know update builds based on Tasha's or you know do a whole episode on it something like that I think my plan right now and I, I think I mentioned this already but my plan is for the episode next week to basically do an entire episode just updating all of the builds that I've done that thus far as per Tasha's Cauldron of Everything and, and how it may alter and affect that. And then just going forward, um, you know, it will be there as an option. The subclasses, the spells, all those things, it will be there in a, as an option as I'm looking at and creating new builds. And of course, if you see something that is interesting or you think drastically alters stuff, um, you know, let me know. Or if there's a particular build that you think is, is compelling. Uh, thanks to some new information and new rules and options and things that we get out of Tasha's. Uh, let's talk about it. So anyway, that was it. Thank you. Um, yeah, have a great day.